Hey guys, Steve Passanelli here with Tech Savvy Agent with another tip for you about Facebook. Let's face it, Facebook is pretty darn easy to use. If it wasn't, a third of all internet traffic wouldn't be on Facebook. But some say it still is cluttered and some people or some agents I've talked to uh, still don't really know how to navigate around Facebook and, uh, and other people like my mom. My mom still doesn't really know how to navigate around Facebook too. So that's why they have a Facebook Lite. Let me go over the differences between regular Facebook and Facebook Lite and why you may want to log into Facebook Lite sometimes as opposed to Facebook.com. So let's take a look. Here I'm on my, uh, my feed page in Facebook, uh, basically the home screen within Facebook and I can I can see my information on the left hand side of the page, newsfeed, messages, events, photos, friends, applications, games. On the right hand side of the page here I can see my requests and suggestions, sponsored events and again connect with friends and then I have my newsfeed right in the center of the page. It's not too busy but it is a little bit busy. Let's take a look at what Facebook Lite looks like on the same exact page. Over here I have my Facebook Lite page. That address is Lite L-I-T-E dot Facebook dot com. I can log into the same exact Facebook profile and view the same information, but notice how it dropped the profile section over here on the left hand side. I simply just see the posts. I don't have as many options on the top of the page here either. It has people you may know still, and it only has one ad on the side without having the events and the connect with friends and the suggestions. Uh, and it's just a much cleaner and simpler page. Let's take a look at the difference between the profile pages too within Facebook and Facebook Lite. I'm going to click on the profile page in Facebook Lite and also click on the profile page over here in Facebook. Let's start off with the Lite page. Here's a picture of me and my lovely wife Gretchen. I have some tabs on the left hand side of the screen here and my latest posts in the center of the page or what other people have posted on my page. Also there's only one ad on the side of my screen here. Let's look at the difference between the regular Facebook page. As you can see of course my photo is still over here but I have my information, I have friends information uh, on the left hand side of the screen if we scroll down there's photos, there's videos not only on my posts here uh, but it tells me that Steve commented on Alicia's, Alicia's status Steve wrote on Gabriel Frederick's wall and you see all these extra posts in between or extra activity posts in between my normal posts that's because it's normal Facebook. If we look back over on the Facebook Lite, it's actually skipping all of that information. Also, if you look at the right hand side of the page of the normal Facebook page, there are three ads. And again, on Facebook Lite, there is only one ad. So it is a little bit cleaner looking. And some people do like the layout uh, and the accessibility of Facebook Lite. It's easy to use, it's easy to get there, and if you're one of those people that don't want to see all of this extra information, log in and give it a shot. That is your tip of the week, or actually I think we gave you a couple tips here this week, uh, but that's a great tip for Facebook that, that you can implement and, and use yourself and tell your family members about. So I hope you guys learned a little bit, a little bit here today about the uh, Facebook Lite version, and stay tuned for much more posts or many more posts from Tech Savvy Agent.